Holly McCann here, and I wanna share with you guys today the very first home I ever purchased, which was a condo. And I'm gonna tell you the whole story about it right now. Um, some people get their first home purchase under their belt when they're a little bit older, but I was only 21. I graduated from college in three years, thanks to some AP credits and working really hard in high school and powering through. So I graduated, um, right when I was 20 years old and went to work for Ernst & Young, big CPA firm, fresh out of college, right by South Coast Plaza in Costa Mesa. And I looked around at apartments for rent. I was gonna rent an apartment with a girlfriend and they seemed so expensive back at the time. The, the luxury apartments there were like, I wanna say like $1,200 a month. And I'm like, oh, got so much money. That's just like throwing money away on rent. Even then, my parents weren't in real estate or anything. I just really had this urge to own something. So I started shopping for condos. I got um, pre-approved for a loan with the help of my dad. I didn't make enough money. I made $26,000 a year back in um, when I graduated in 1989 and that wasn't enough to qualify. So my dad co-signed for me. I lived at home, saved up money, and had saved up enough for an FHA loan, three and a half percent down. And then we went looking at condos. And back in the old days, before there were, um, before computers were as prevalent, and there were certainly no smartphones, my realtor would take me and my dad around on Sunday afternoons, and she had her little printout from the MLS, and there was no photos, like we couldn't see anything. So it was always a big surprise when we went to a, a new condo complex of like, oh, this one's really nice. Oh, this one sucks. I would not live there. So we did these little discovery tours for probably three months. I think we started in January of 1990 and I didn't purchase anything until April. So that poor realtor, oh, we drug her around a lot of places and we were always looking at two bedroom places because I thought that's all there was. And then my friend at Ernst & Young, also working in the tax department, I remember Mary Doyle. Mary, if you ever see this, thank you for inspiring me. <laughs> she was telling me about getting a condo really close to our office. And it was a three bedroom and it was like $135,000. I'm like, what? How did you get a three bedroom place? I didn't even know those existed. So I went and checked him out with my realtor. I told her about the complex. And I did get a three bedroom, two bath condo, just under a thousand square feet. And I don't remember exactly how much it was, but it was right around $135,000. I did my FHA loan with three and a half percent down. So what does that come out to? I mean, the down payment and closing costs were uh, maybe 15 grand, um, maybe it was a little bit more. And then I borrowed some additional funds from my dad, even though I'd been saving, I didn't have enough and um, I got my first place. So I was super excited about that. I rented out two of the three bedrooms to two other single ladies, I remember for $400 a month. And I got one um, designated carport parking space and one like free space in the open place with a permit. So I gave the two ladies the parking spaces and since I could walk to and from work, I would find alternate parking like on the street or just leave my car in the parking garage and the big office tower for Ernst & Young sometimes um, over, you know, overnight and over time. So it was an interesting setup, but I was so excited to get into the real estate market and start building wealth and equity for myself and not my landlord. So it took some, a lot of work and planning and even a co-signer for myself, but it was how me as a single woman making $26,000 a year, was able to get my first place. I have a, a young client right now who's 22 and she saved way more money than I did and she's getting her first place right now. So I'm definitely gonna um, interview her and do a video with her. I'm super impressed with her and proud of her and so excited that she is not gonna have to throw, throw away money on rent and get her first place, which is also a three bedroom, two bath condo and she's gonna rent out rooms too. So we'll tell her story in another video miss anna so we'll talk to anna sometime in the future but i just wanted you guys to know i got my start a long 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 time ago at age 21. Um, i had only been out of college less than a year when i bought my first place and did have the help of my father and i borrowed money and paid it back and had him co-sign on the loan with me but that was how i got in so 
If you are trying to get your first place, um, think about creative solutions, hit me up. I'm happy to talk through ideas with you to help you be able to acquire a place. And thanks so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe for more great real estate content and videos.